We have attached a secondary video camera to the device so you can easily view the screen during our recording. As you can see, the main video camera is currently recording the user and the secondary one is recording the screen. In this part, we will introduce you to the beach mode of the Golden Gate Plus 3D. First, the user is selecting the beach mode in the search mode menu. Then he is selecting ground balance on the main menu and performing the ground balance process following the animated steps on the screen. Now the ground balance process is completed and the user is starting his search. Please remember that beach sands act unlike other types of soil. Because it contains high amounts of salt, it is extremely conductive. It is sensed as another piece of metal by detectors, misleading the user. Golden Gate Plus 3D filters out the conductive effect of the sand and the user performs his search easily on the beach as shown in the video. The user is checking the ground to see whether there is any metal present prior to his detection test with the sample metal. The user is getting no metal signal. So we are digging a hole 20 centimeters deep to bury the coin. He is checking again to see whether there is any object that may generate a metal signal in the hole and as you can see no signal is being detected. So we are placing the coin in the hole and before we fill up the hole the user is detecting the coin with the Golden Gate Plus 3D. Now we are filling up the hole and the device easily detects the buried coin at 20 centimeters. Users usually search for pieces of jewelry, such as rings, necklaces, earrings, etc. on the beach. Now we will dig a hole 20 centimeters deep, bury a silver ring inside and detect it. Before burying the ring, the user is checking to see whether there is any object that may generate a metal signal in the hole, and as you can see, no signal is being detected. First, he is detecting the ring before filling up the hole. After we fill up the hole, he is detecting the ring again, holding the coil approximately 5 cm above the ground, so he is actually detecting the buried ring from 25 cm. The user now is saying that he will detect a gold nugget at 10 cm depth on beach sand. As seen on the video, we are digging a hole 10 cm deep. First, the user is checking to see whether there is any object that may generate a metal signal in the hole, and as you can see, no signal is being detected. We are placing the nugget in the hole, and the user is detecting it by sweeping the coil over it. Now we are filling up the hole. and the Golden Gate Plus 3D easily detects the buried nugget at 10 cm depth in beach sand.
The user is now saying that he will detect a single staple at 10 cm depth in beach sand with the Golden Gate Plus 3D. As you can see, we are placing the staple on the sand. and the detector senses it right away. As we have mentioned in previous videos, beach sand is extremely conductive and most detectors will not perform well on these grounds. They will lose depth and miss the target or they will generate false signals misleading the user. Here the user is easily detecting a small staple which you can hardly see from 10 centimeters with the Golden Gate Plus 3D. Now we are digging a hole 10 centimeters deep. The user is first checking the hole again to see whether there is any object that may generate a metal signal in the hole, and as you can see, no signal is being detected. Now we are placing the staple inside the hole. The user is sweeping the coil over it, and the device detects it straight away. We are filling up the hole and the Golden Gate Plus 3D detects the buried staple at 10 cm depth easily in beach sand, which due to its conductive nature is tough ground to work on for any detector. The user will continue his tests with a larger piece of metal now to perform a deeper detection. We have a hole 50 cm deep. He is first checking the hole again to see whether there is any metal signal. As you can see, no signal is detected. You can currently see the depth of the hole on the ruler. Now we place a 10 by 10 centimeter aluminium plate in the hole. As you can see, the Golden Gate Plus 3D detects the target easily and shows the detection on the screen. Now we fill up the hole. Again, the user easily detects the buried target at 50 cm depth with the Golden Gate Plus 3D. Now, the user will get the depth and dimensions in the 3D graph of the target. He does the confirmation scans, or in other words an X scan, over the target. The bar located on the left of the screen indicates the depth range of the scan, which is 100 cm. As you currently see on the screen, the icon is located at the middle of the bar, so the Golden Gate Plus 3D indicates that the target is around 50 cm deep. Now the user is zooming in on the 3D graph and getting the dimensions of the target. The dimensions indicated by the device are 8 cm by 9 cm which is very close to the actual dimensions. Golden Gate Plus 3D search coils are waterproof, so the device allows searching and detection in the water as well. It does not lose depth and it provides for comfortable use in water. As you can currently see on the video, 
the user is submerging the coil in the water and starting his search. He does not get any target signals. Now he is placing a piece of metal in the sand underwater. And as you can see, the device easily detects the metal in the sand under the water and shows it on the screen.